And one of the ships you can see up close this week has been involved in some missions that you could say are out of this world. In fact, our Kelsey Thord spoke with a Navy officer who has helped NASA prepare for a historic splashdown. Officer Avery Fries is only in her early 20s, but has already experienced so much aboard the USS John P. Murtha. I graduated in 2022 as a surface warfare officer. Uh, we go through our series of schools and I checked on board in October of last year, uh, right before the ship's most recent deployment. During that deployment, Officer Fries and the rest of the crew traveled across the Indo-Pacific region. They arrived back in the U.S. in July and soon after began training with NASA for its upcoming Artemis II crewed mission around the moon. Officer Fries was one of the lucky crew members who got to participate in the training exercise, practicing how the Navy and NASA will work together to recover the Artemis II capsule, which will be carrying the mission's four astronauts when it splashes down in the Pacific Ocean. We got to see everything from helos recovering people in baskets um, during the day to watching the ship at sunset at night, uh, hanging out with the capsule and learning so much from the divers and the NASA crew was truly uh, something I am so blessed to experience. Now, Officer Fries is taking on a new role. This Fleet Week, she will be the one giving tours of the USS John P. Murtha to the thousands of civilians expected to board the ship. We have uh, been planning for about a month to give the tours to the public and being able uh, to show everyone uh, what we do and our craft. And we have been at sea uh, operational for about two years and being able to pull into port and show the public uh, what we do and show off uh, our main capability is what we're really excited about. The tour includes a look at the ship's inner workings from the flight deck where helicopters land to where the sailors and Marines eat and sleep to the well deck where amphibious vehicles can launch. Officer Fries says she's excited to give people up close and personal access to the ship and is confident they'll love it as much as she does. I love my job. I would not want to be anywhere else. I would not want to be on any other ship, um, but I am just super blessed to be able to be able to experience it on the John P. Murtha with the crew that we have. Tours of the USS John P. Murtha will be offered through Monday. They're available to the public free of charge. CBS News Bay Area is the official media partner for San Francisco Fleet Week. We will have live special coverage all week long leading up to our Friday Spectacular. We will bring you the parade of ships live at 11 a.m. with the Blue Angels live at 3.